Hi, it's Taylor of the Taylor Love Tales All Show. And recently I was watching Wendy Williams and she was doing her segment as Wendy. There was this young lady on there and she asked when she was telling Wendy that she had recently met this guy. They've been dating for about four months and they had all this chemistry. And she decided to show the picture of her new boo to her bestie who just happens to be a um, gay guy. And the bestie says, hey, I done hooked up with this dude before. So Wendy's looking at her like, okay, what do you want from me? So the girl says, and I just, you know, want to know what to do. And Wendy says, well, have you guys been intimate before? And the young lady says, no, and I ain't really buying that. And so Wendy says, okay, then what do you want? She said, well, I just want him to admit it and, you know, and tell the truth. And I just like for us to remain friends. In my mind, I'm thinking she still want to uh, keep that thing going on. And so Wendy says, well, I don't like men who are sexually fluid. And that was the first time I had heard that phrase because I use bisexual. But okay, it's sexually fluid now. And I feel the same way. I want a man who's just into women. But they're, you know, but why is it okay that men are all right with women being sexually fluid. They think it's sexy, a little girl on girl. You know, they want to be all about it. But when a guy is sexually fluid or bisexual, it seems to be taboo. Now, I'm not saying what you, su what you should do, what you shouldn't do. I know what works for me. And you have to do what works best for you. But for me... People need to be honest with their sexuality when they're starting to date and be in relationships. This is no time to be playing around with those kind of things. So stay safe, stay protected, and don't forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel, Tell a Love Tells All. Smooches!